Good morning. Bring some coffee. Already shot one video. Here's number two. This is Thursday, July 13, 2017. It's 9.30 a.m. Eastern Daylight Savings Time in the mountains of Virginia. Let's try some coffee. Mm. And this is not a crystal, but I still like it. It's glass. But because of the way it's cut, it's crystal-like. And it does make great rainbows on the wall when the sun hits it to dr directly or take it outside. It's got a silver, silvery back. Uh, let's put that out of the way. And appropriate enough, I'm going to do the uh, Radiant Rider Weight Tarot. Nothing special here, and lots of people have done this before, so I'll try to go as quickly as I can. But there are the um, major, I mean, Trump's the Major Arcana, and what's the one I always pick up? I think I always pick up the Death Card, or the Fool. And these are nice colors and very clear background. I do use this occasionally, not very often. That's nice. A star card. Hold that up. And what's the other one? I guess the fool, I hold that up. Or the magician. That's pretty nice. Uh, the backs look like that, which I like. They could, they could have, for me anyway. Let's see if it's a standard size. It should be since it's U.S. Games. I always keep grabbing that one. Let's grab something with colors on it. Yeah, it's 100% the same. Card stock and everything. This might be a little thick. Nah, they're the same. So, hmm. be even nicer without that border. I think I've seen people trim it. I thought what, what, I, when I think back on this one, I thought it was in a, a tin, but it's not. It's just a regular tuck box. I don't know why I thought that. Probably watched too many other people's reviews. It has two extra cards in there. Based on Drawings by Pamela Coleman-Smith. There's the back again. And the Radiant Weight Tarot. Infuses bold, bright colors. Okay, we got that. That's, those are nice. I'll just put one on each end here. And of course, the little white puck. Which is little and white. I won't go into that any. And then the uh, minor. For some reason out of order. Let's just do this really fast. Since other people have done these. See now I like that one. The building kind of. Kind of stands out for me a bit more. And they're not as big. Interesting how they do different takes on these. Uh, let's just put it out of the way. That was pentacles. This is swords. And of course it says that at the bottom of every card. This is pretty obvious. They're swords. Hello. There, I like that one. Hmm. Interesting. And the cups. And again, I'm not going to ever babble on about these unless I change my mind, <laughs> which isn't likely. <laughs> but because lots of people, oh, wow, that's, I guess I don't recall that. That's a big improvement. Very clear. Hmm. See, that one's 
too clear. It should be more dim, I think. But hey, that's just me. I'll never do these full reviews that go on and on and on because there are other people that do them much better than Kelly of Truth and Story and uh, Simon. Even though his, you're kind of forced to, I don't know, it does that card flip thing. And they, they have their face in their wands. But other people do a much better job of this. I'm just basically documenting. And if I add anything to any of it that's out there already, it's that these are at, this is being recorded at 1080p, so it's a higher resolution than most of these people are showing it at. So where's the death card? I'll put you on top of justice. And we'll put the little white book over this way. Ooh, things are moving. And with that, since I still have at least, I think I counted yesterday, 15 more decks. Maybe it was 18. Something like that. Let's say 20. I still have 20 or more, 20 of of these to go plus I've ordered two newish ones I think so whew, it takes a while to go through your decks so with that this was the Rider I mean the Radiant Rider Weight Tarot that one <laughs> and I'll let it go for a second get the microphone out of the way if it's in the way so I can capture this image and with that, I'll say peace.